Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Tyson's Day. Let me show you guys how to get, get the brand new badge area of for the Bear factory. Star. The, All personnel must the leave Grand the Master Badge. So the first thing you guys want to do All is go to Cheese Factory. And what you guys want to do, you want to go upstairs right here, go through this little hole. You're going to go all the way over here. So you want to go over here, and you're going to look under a desk where you would find something. So let's go under there. Now, right into this room, look under the desk, and there is a code. 48382. So you got to put in that code into the chat. It's a random, too. It's always a different code. So there we go. We have the code. We put it in. And now we want to go over here now. So don't want to put that in. So you gotta click two buttons now, which is kind of like Bear Alpha's thing that they did for atrocity, atrocity which I think that's kind of cool. So there's a, one up here, which there's one right here, but that one does not open until you press the one downstairs. So you want to go down here and to the, through here, and then go to the right here through here and then in this room once again you gotta press a button under a desk so look under there and there is a pink little button it's so nice since you press that one let's go into portal um you want to go all the way back up again so you go all the way back up here remember guys i'm bear so this is portal we can only do this as a bear and, and now you gotta get a card as a subscriber so you just press the button but you got but you guys, if you, you gotta collect the card now since we opened up a door downstairs. And you you can only be a survivor to pick it up. No bear. So now let's go down here. We got this little room. And you gotta put in whatever the code you saw was. You wanna put it in here. So I wanna put it in. Okay, so let's see survivor do it. So let's see. And there is the card. So they pick it up. Okay, so they pick up the card. And they're gonna come where we are. So we're gonna... So we're gonna wait for them to come. So yeah, we're gonna come over here, and then there's a little key card you have to open up. So you want to come in here. There we go. You open it up, and there's a little sewer. So you walk to the end of this little valley sewer, and then this starts our big journey, which we go have a big adventure in the sewers, the Blocks Brothers sewers episode. So you now, so now we're in here, all right? So we got the key card. We're, we're gonna keep going over here. Let's just follow our directions because this can get a little tricky for new people. And I gotta say, there's a lot of detail. I mean, like, this is very big. This probably took a long time. So now I'm gonna take a right there through that little broken one. And another one right here. Now, this time you wanna take a left there. I think it looks so, yeah, guys, mostly kind of follow the metal pipes a little bit. They kind of lead you. Do not go into this room, guys. Don't go into this one, right? Because it does nothing. So we're going to keep going over here. Now you want to take a... Yeah, right. You want to take a right. Now you see Henry McMaster over there. So now I'm going to go here to the left and go around through this little bridge right here. Make sure not to fall because he will die. And I think this is cool to see what the underground or cheese factory looks like. So now you guys see this. You want to jump onto the rail. Kind of jump across a bit, and let's keep going. Oh, we just slipped on the cheese. Okay, keep going around here through the doors. Now I'm gonna take a yep left turn right here. Now we got this room right here. A bunch of gateways looks like. So we got gateway number seven right there. Now we go this way, but don't go that way. You gotta take this way. This straight, just go straight. Now guys, at this point you gotta follow these red boxes. If you don't follow them, then that's and then you guys gotta try and find them. But you gotta keep following the red boxes. So there's one right there. Let's see if we can find another one. Let's check over here. Okay, yeah, there's one right there. Guys, there's a bunch of red boxes too. And so I just keep following them. Okay, there's one down here. Guys, okay, so there's one. Guys, prediction. What are we gonna find next? A red box or the badge? Nope, just another red box. <laughs> so this is, we just, this is just the way to go. Um, yeah, so yeah, I'm gonna go down here. There's another one. There's another one way over here. And now I wanna take a pathway over here. Okay, so we're gonna keep on going down here. It's all right. Okay, there's one. Go around this corner. Oh, this one's a little bit of a hall. Long hallway. Go. 
Okay, so here's something different. We got this room. So, you guys, right here, what you want to do is go to the left over here. And there we go. There's a little hole. And you guys want to go down this little hole right here. So, there we are. We fell down. And nice little details. I like. I really, really like this. And then go through here. And you guys are going to drop down. And then, once again, we got to follow more red boxes. So, you guys want to go he over here to the right. Just keep going. And there, there's more red boxes you got to find. So there's one, okay, this one looks like we gotta drop down. So guys, tip, if, there, if there's always one really close to a ladder, like right there, like that one right there, you, you always have to fall down. You go down here, another one. Alright, we're doing pretty good so far. Oh, this long hallway. I'm gonna take a left here. Oh yeah, there's one right there. Now we're gonna jump up here onto the ladder. Another one right there. Okay, now we gotta jump up the ladder. Okay, guys, we're almost there. We're about to make it. And there we are. Okay, guys, so here we are now in this room. So first thing you guys wanna do is pick up this key since it's important for later. There we go, we picked up the key. So now the next thing we gotta guys do is this button here activates a flood, which you guys have to escape from it. And it's basically pretty hard. This is most likely the hardest part of this which I think so. Count of three, we'll do it. One, two, three. Okay, now see it starts flooding. We gotta hurry up and get through this gate and do this little parkour very fast. Okay, so we gotta go very fast right here. Whoa, the water's already coming. Okay, there we go. Okay, so the easier ones when you got the pipes and boxes for this hallway, that's the easier one. Or personally, in my opinion, it is. Okay, we're gonna do all this. Make sure, guys, you follow the the pipes here. If you guys want to follow that? That's how you know what to do. Okay, so here we are. Following that, go upstairs now. Okay, do this right here. I'm gonna keep going for now. Okay, keep going. Then we got this part here. We're gonna jump up very fast. Gonna go very fast here now. Remember, guys, try your absolute hardest. You need to be very skilled to do this. It does contain a lot of parkour. So here we are, going up here. And we're going down. I'm gonna go up again. Oh no, guys, we went the wrong way. That's not very good. Hey guys, I'm gonna keep going right here. Try your absolute best. Okay guys, we're about to make it through. Basically the last part almost. Oh, come on guys. Okay, there we go. We did it. We got through it guys. So that is the end of the flood part. So the guys, you basically just got through the hardest part right there. Okay, now once you're done there, you gotta go. I'm gonna go over here. So I'm gonna cut through here very fast. I'm gonna go through this. Now what you guys wanna do, you wanna go up here, get onto that, like that. I'm gonna jump on the gate, there we are. Use the key, right there. There we are. Press the main power button. Now some power's turned off. You wanna go through here now. And so eventually, now you're gonna come over here. And so this is the hard part, guys. You guys gotta find some key cards. They can spawn in different areas. So you guys wanna find a key card. And you gotta open different things. And you also gotta find a battery by doing some parkour. So you guys wanna check. They can spawn in different areas. And then we gotta find them. So how about we check over here now. There could be one here. Who knows. Uh, so you can't go in there. Uh, let's check this room over here. Okay, so that's a blue key card. We'll check this one too, in case. 
Um, alright. So we got this little, little laboratory area. So let's see if it can spawn here. So far, it does not look like anything spawn here. So how about we go downstairs now, shall we? Uh, let's check here. Ooh, still nothing. Okay, so this one's a little tricky. Okay, use that right there. Okay, so we can't use it on that one, as you guys can see. So guys, this is basically a repetitive loop. This is what I can explain from this. Okay, is it spawning in here? Okay, no, it's not spawned in there. Let's go back upstairs now. Yeah, we checked that area already. There's also this here. We still haven't found anything. On the looking out for these things. Very careful. Aha, there we go, guys. There we are with the blue key card. So we got the blue key card finally. So now we can open some rooms we've not gone in yet. So let's check in this room right here. Just a few boxes. So this is making this is making some progress now. Much better. You guys, the blue key card is what you blue and pink are mostly the ones that are important. And also, guys, you can use these ones, the blue ones, the ones that are higher uh, than the red one. You can use those to open the other ones. Check in here. Is there a blue one here? Wait. Okay, so now I want to check in here. So if you guys don't know, you got to check around this place very, very, very well. And there we go, guys. We found the pink one right up here, the fifth clearance. So that's great. And since we got that, we got to use it. Okay. So first things first, we hold this thing out because now we don't need to just hold out the blue one all the time. This one can open any of the doors. So we gotta find this one door. All right. Yeah, so this is one we need after we get the battery. Okay, so guys, this is what you need to do. A little bit of hard parkour. You guys wanna be so careful here. You don't want to die and screw up because you've gone this far. Okay. There we are. We did that. Okay, guys. So now we're going to do this here. Okay, so now we're gonna open this up here. And so now we got that. I'm gonna open it like that. And now you guys wanna take this battery right here. And then we're gonna go down with it. So now I wanna be very careful here that we don't fall. So we pick this up. I'm gonna go across here. Go across here. Okay guys, so now we open that up. And guys, now there is a button to to basically turn on the power. So, reset. And the power is back on. So guys, now the power is back on. So guys, if you don't do that step, you guys are going to be playing it in the dark. So make sure to do this. So guys, now I want to get the power back on. Okay, I'm gonna go back to that door. I'm gonna go to back to a door. So what we wanna do is find this door. So here we are. All right, good. Go back upstairs. Okay. 
nope, that's not where we go. So, here's a little confusing, guys. Nope, not in there. Okay, we'll check with this one now. And it should be somewhere around here. Alright, yeah. Over here at the end. Okay, guys, so then I'm gonna go d down here. And now we got the power on. Okay, guys, so what you want to do is put all three of the cards in all three of the slots to get some power. Okay, now I'm going to put the battery. The battery goes in there. Now we're going to do it. Access granted. Okay, guys, so now we turn the lights back on. I mean, it's a lot easier to see. Okay, so there's the train. We're going to go past it. Okay. So you guys, save your sprint for this. What's about to happen? We keep going forward, guys. Okay, guys. So it's gonna be pretty easy to see because we turn on the lights now. So here we are. Keep going. And eventually, we'll find this Henry McMaster, right in here. Hmm. And you got some cool skins there, like an ultimate epic hot sauce, like an orange there. One of these skins would never get added. Okay, so we're going to go around them. Guys, so now the bears will chase after you got to get away from them. My tip is just go around in circles. This is what I personally think is the easiest thing to do. Okay, well, he got past that one pretty good, the blue one there. That one looks like arm ears almost. That one's kind of funny. So we're going to keep running from these guys. This is pretty easy. You just got to survive for a bit of time. Okay, so now we only got the two going after us now. So you guys just gotta find a way to deke them out. The blue one seems to be a little stuck there. Okay, guys, so let's see if we can do a challenge. Just do not lose any health at all. Uh, we're about to do it. Yeah. Oh, come on, keep going. Oh, there we are. Henry McMaster now runs away because he's a scaredy cat. And because... Oh, there's a cat bear up there. We gotta take a second to appreciate this, these skins. Like, these are so cool. Oh my god, it's voodoo. What? They have voodoo bear. Guys, they gotta add these skins in this. They couldn't now just made these skins for nothing. So now, since the guys turned on the lights, it's so much easier to see when you're in here. Keep running to the end, and then we'll find Henry McMaster, the security cat. Because he saw that I defeated his bear army. I'm gonna keep going over here. Over here to the right. Keep going. We're going to do it, guys. This is the last thing we got to do. Oh, well, guys, perfect. So now we just want to run to the ed end of here. And you guys got the new badge. And there we are. A Grandmaster badge. There you go, guys. So that is a badge. So there we are. We're returning to Bear Star. Okay, guys. So now since we are here... Go to inventory, and now if you look here for survivor skins, there's a new survivor skin here, Henry McMaster. And now, the new kill effect we got, Violaxum, and then last but not least, the greatest gear of all time, Live Laugh Cheese Mug. So here's Henry McMaster's survivor skin. I like this one, I think it looks pretty cool. I like his outfit, he has a little wrench right there, Henry, and he's a CEO it looks like. And also, one thing I like, he has like the Walsh and Gromit looking shirt. Now, the mug. This is beautiful. Ooh, the animations. Oh, he barfs. Oh, he just pours it. Oh, it must taste very good. Was it cheese flavored ch coffee? Oh, that would be awful. But I like cheese, though. It's such a good animation. Anyways, now let's see the kill fare. Okay, guys, so now, last but not least, let's check out the Violaxum kill effect. So I'm gonna go over to Survivor Spawn. There is an unknown entity that has been identified Keep going there. The area. Also, I think this makes a good combo. The cheese factory combo. Okay, let's see it. 
that's pretty cool. It's like the leech kill effect almost, which leech is my favorite. That one's pretty cool. It's like what you do to burn atrocity to get the skin. That's really awesome. Anyways, guys, I hope you, I hope you, this helps you guys get the new badge. It is pretty tricky. Not a lot of people have gotten it so far, and people are finding it very hard. It's one of the biggest badges in, or longest badges to earn, uh, like Vector Bear from early stages of Bear Star. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this video and subscribe to the channel. Goodbye. Give a comment down below. What did you find the hardest badge to get in Bear Star? Anyways, guys, goodbye.